obviously led to the title. Yeah. How are you guys finding that same motivation going into this season, obviously coming off the highest of highs? Um, well, for me, just going back and looking at the video again, puts me in the same spot. The anger, all the things put together in me, make me, they drive me. They want to make me get better. But that also help, helps me with my leadership. You know, sometimes it gets hard. You're trying to get people to understand what you've been through, so they know, just so they're prepared for what's coming. And I might not understand, but if, if, well, every time that I look at UMBC and I don't want that to happen, I keep fighting. And that's the reason why uh, I feel like that's underneath our skin. It will never go away. Curiosity, not just about basketball, mm -hmm. but about your classes, about yeah. learning things off the court. Mm -hmm. well. Yes, always. Always. You've been asked I'm always this. engaged in, into stuff. I, I, if I know I'm putting my foot into two feet, if I, I know I'm uh, volunteering for something, I'm all the way in. I'm two foot into it. If not, I'm not. So you've been asked a lot of times about the draft process and how it helped your uh, yeah. uh, improvement as a player, your development as a player. But yeah. how how has how, how have you seen improvements in yourself since that process? I've seen a lot of improvement. Um, <laughs> I still don't know how to answer to this question. Sure. Uh, in many ways, I, I've gotten better, and uh, as the season goes through, we'll, we'll find out. Sure. But yeah, definitely my shooting got better. I'm able to stretch the floor more. Uh, I still got what I had before. I just put more in, on, on top of that. So that doesn't mean I'm, I'm not gonna play defense. No, I wanna play defense. I want My defense has gotten better. I want it to be at this different level. But I'm, I also work on my weaknesses. And yeah, I'm just, I just try to elevate myself to another level. Uh, Coach Bennett used a lot of four guard lineups a mm -hmm. lot last year. Obviously, that was a big part of the success mm -hmm. of last year's team. But this year's team, it seems like uh, we can expect a lot of you and Jay yeah. playing together a lot. It's going to be longer. Yeah, longer. Mm -hmm. and, and how how different is that going to be then with, you know, your, your responsibilities may change a little bit yeah. just because there's two bigs instead of just one yeah. in the lineup. Um, I mean, I'm fine with anything. Since I first got here, Coach knew what was my commitment to him. I said anything to help the team. That could be defensively offensively but I could be guarding the guard. Guarding someone you're uncomfortable guarding. But I'm comfortable guarding guarding or a big. So you talked about the UMBC monster mm -hmm. sort of staying under your skin. Yeah. What exactly does that mean and how much do you think about it? How much does it still motivate you on a daily basis or I, mean, I don't think so too much about it. I just think about it whenever I go through hardships and it drives me. It, it, he sends me a message, and that message is keep going, don't stop. Uh, you're gonna get what you want uh, for sure if you keep if you keep learning. Because that I don't want to be in that state of mind anymore. After, after winning the national championship, how hungry are you guys entering this season? Very hungry, still hungry. Um, we'll prove in this season. How about that? How, how is that? Not, not trying. I'm not gonna go through so much in the way, but go ahead. How's the chemistry with the guys in practice with so many new guys? It's been it's been pretty well. It's been going pretty well. Um, I'm I, I'm excited for the new guys. Um, we are we have a lot of talent, mm -hmm. and I think they're they're gonna be just fine. This Opening up. Go ahead, Jeff. You've been around long enough to spend some time around Justin Anderson. Mm -hmm. I've been told that Justin and McCoy talks even more than Justin. <laughs> oh, Anderson definitely. That, what, how would you describe? Young Justin's personality. Young, which one? Justin the one? McCoy. McCoy. Yeah. I'll say Justin Anderson times five. <laughs> yeah, basically. Um, now, now he changed a little bit. <laughs> He's more, I won't say quiet, but he knows when to do it. He know. I mean, he, he he's a freshman, so coming in, he didn't know what to expect. So he was doing, you know, it, it was a little all over. So we were able to like pull him in and, and teach him the ways. And now he knows when to do it on the court. He seems like on the court he's a guy who competes the whole yep. time. Like yep. whether he's doing something good or he's doing yep. it hundred percent. Yeah. That, 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 uh, and I, I talked to him a little bit about that. At first he was 
struggling a little bit. Sometimes he would tell me, oh, I had a bad practice. Uh, it's pissing me off. So I'll come and tell him, yo, it doesn't matter. Man. Put that behind you. It happened. You focus on what you can control. And if that's helping it, your team defensively or offensively, do that. Whatever you need to do to help your team, do that. Don't worry about your mistakes. Just keep, keep going. And I think that has helped him a lot. The experiences that you had over the, you know, either the NBA draft mm -hmm. staff, the Nike camp. Yeah. How much are you looking forward to putting that stuff to do? Oh, now? a lot. I'm, I'm very much looking forward to, to the season right now. I think it's going to be a fun season. Uh, I, I'm ready for all those. Uh, I want to. I don't want to start a drama, but and I've been hearing a lot of stuff. <laughs> so I'm I'm ready for it. That's that's basically what I'm saying. I'm I'm ready for it. We're all ready for it. Uh, we're, we've been working really hard. Coach has been pushing us at practice very hard, but uh, we're ready for it. Where's your game different after after some of the things you picked up over the summer? Um, just I, okay. I got more. I have more experience. Um, I'm handling the ball more uh, outside. I'm, I'm able to stretch the floor, with my shooting, and. I have a better court vision, many more. I can go on and on, but like, yeah. How much are you just like, cause you're kind of going to be, you know, the man to a certain extent. How much are you looking forward to stepping into that kind of role? How much I'm looking into stepping in that kind of role? <laughs> I'm ready right now. <laughs> I love challenges. I think without challenge, without a challenge, uh, a man is not a man really without it. Uh, you need that to become a man real man you know what i'm saying i know what you're saying <laughs> exactly like a man a real man you need, a real man needs a, a a challenge and he needs to be able to overcome those challenges in order to be to, to graduate or to, to take another step forward what do you think about this team being a marked team as being the national champs say that again teams coming at you they're gonna yeah. play their best against you as, as the national champs oh that just tell us we gotta get ready, mm -hmm. and it's, I think it's good for us. If teams were coming to us look warm, I think we wouldn't be ready. But we know what's coming, so that push us at practice to get better. How ready are you for that season opener at Syracuse? We will see once, once the tip off. Well, what have you seen in practice? Does the team look like a team that's ready? Yep, we're ready. Cool. Thanks, my buddy. I have one more important basketball question. You went with the blonde look last year. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, uh, and my wife would be mad if I didn't ask you. Yeah. Uh, uh, and you've kept it. So yeah. it, 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 a lot of good things happen after yeah. you went blonde. Mm -hmm. uh, talk about the hair and just, and you're, I think if I remember right, your mom at first wasn't too receptive yeah, to it. she wasn't too receptive to it. How is she now? She's, she's okay about it. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Maybe after the season, I'll take it off. Maybe I won't. I don't know yet. But uh, as of now, um, my plan is to keep it for the whole season. Good luck. Yeah. <laughs> what, uh, what about?